the amount of friends I actually found dead in sleeping bags in the winter in London was unbelievable. It is a pretty horrendous prospect to consider, really, but it happens too often in winter. The average temperature across the UK last night was below zero, well below in some cities. And tucked away in doorways, the homeless sleep or try to. Some hope to be noticed, others don't want to be. All of them, though, need help. It is slippery, yeah. There is someone there. Is it? Yeah. Is, are they awake? Petra Salva and Mohammed Rahman do this night after night. They work for the charity Thames Reach, which tries to locate rough sleepers and offer what it can. Tell me. Well, there's someone there, someone sleeping there. Do you think you can put the camera down for a second? Sure. I'll talk to them because we don't know who they are. Thanks. Sure. Thank you. Never okay. seen before. Um, he doesn't want any help. We've, we've offered him. Okay, so where's he from? Poland? He wouldn't, he wouldn't give me his nationality. But you, you think he's from... Um... I think he's from one of those A10 countries. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Mohammed explains that the man is what's known as an A10 from Eastern Europe. He doesn't want help. Perhaps he's here illegally. That's not their concern, but they can't force him inside. And so they move on. We're, we're here to offer you accommodation. You sure you don't want to come in? Yeah, I'm we can get you into B&B, we can get you into a hostel, we can get you in wherever you like. We'll still sleep there tonight despite our offers of bed and breakfast, despite our offers of um, hostel placement. Why do you think that is? Because he's not well. He's just, he, uh, our belief is he's, he's unwell and un unable to make an informed decision. Across town, another charity, The Connection at St Martin's, is feeding those who do agree to come in. Among them is Dave. People do feel that they're on their own and abandoned and no one really cares. But, you know, uh, they should be more concerned about the homeless now that, that the weather you know, has sort of turned a bit nasty and stuff. And with it turning so early this year, there'll be many more months of this ahead. Mark Stone, Sky News in central London.